Hello, ladies, gentlemen, and other people that are present. No, that's the button I want to press. Hello, I'm here. Um, I've got an episode of Most Haunted to watch. It's a Most Haunted Extra, it's 59 minutes. Uh, it's Coates Memorial... Um, church in Paisley. I know nothing about the place. I know nothing about the episode. It came up in my suggested, and so here we are. Um, how is everyone this evening? Hope you're all having a fantastic time. Um, Nothing not nice here. I think this, this is, is my Carl worst nightmare. Absolutely fantastic. Yeah. To Paisley in Scotland, okay. and a huge good, building matched only by the paranormal activity inside. Rising to more than 60 metres above ground level, the red Can't sandstone Coates Memorial good. Church, built in the Gothic Revival design and topped with a crown spire, is an awe inspiring building. Constructed in 1885 and named after the much-loved philanthropist Thomas Coates, who had died two years earlier, this huge memorial has seen many thousands of people walking through the doors over the years. As congregation members fell, this magnificent building closed its doors to its ecclesiastical origins. However, even though it's now transitioning to a landmark entertainment venue servicing the west of Scotland, some of its past visitors seem to have stayed. With dark shadows, disembodied footsteps, moans, doors slamming and ghostly figures being witnessed all over this vast place, it stands as one of the most haunted places in Scotland. Brilliant. We start on the ground floor. Stuart myself are at Coates Memorial, this huge, huge church at Paisley in Scotland, right near uh, Glasgow. Let me... um, Adjust it's the second. absolutely superb. I mean, we'll show you more of it as we go, but obviously we're interested that in... That should the hopefully get me a little bit louder. there, that bit there, it's supposed to be one of the most haunted areas. So, shall we go, Stu? Absolutely. Yes. Let's go and do it. Let's, you, let's see where you're going. Yeah. Have you got your torch Yeah, I've knocked my volume dial. Grab it now. Just pop your... Yeah. That's loud, that, isn't it? <laughs> The problem we have is all of the infrared lights that we've got that we normally have on top of the, the cameras to just give these infrared lights a little bit more. Every single one of them, they're fully charged and they've all ran out within seconds of being put on when we were testing the Brilliant. kit. So we don't have any. What we do have is Stuart's torch, which will lighten it up a bit. So, uh, this excites me. How are you feeling, Stuart? Well, uh, well, I actually don't know at the moment, if I'm being honest with you. I'm not frightened, scared, and I'm not nervous. It's, it's not like Stuart. It's just a church. I've got no reason to feel any of that, have I? This is the place of worship. You've not, you've not got no reason to, to You've not got any reason to fear a church? Sorry? You haven't got a reason to fear a church? <laughs> not yet, no. <laughs> God sees everything, I remember. I should come bust. You mean? Into flames. Wow, look at this. I mean, it's, it's it eerie. It, it most certainly is eerie. Put the torch down there, Stu. Look at that. Yeah. What have we got here? We've got a cor There's a room here. What's that? Yeah. Oh, it's cool. Yeah, there's the, that's where we are. You've got it's Memorial yeah. Church. <coughs> See, we're yeah. where the public, I guess, would not never come to, is it? No, they'd never come in here. This would be the... Um, so this is the back room, room of the, the church. church. You call them. What's the, people, the maintenance engineers people, engineers, that's right. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, old 
old stained glass. Stained window glass there. How old is that? How many stories could that tell? Wow, I think that sort of workmanship will never be done again. Not to the same exacting standards. No. I don't know what that is. But... Pay for it in such a way that we used to have in churches. Right, let's get out of business. Is anyone here? If you're here, can you show yourself? Touch one of us? Make a sound? Very eerie down there now. Look, looking at all this structural stuff here. It seems quiet side. so far. Usually oh, by now they've had tables thrown. Down, <sighs> Looks industrialised, um, doesn't it? But yeah. currently not a lot. What is down here? How far does it go down? Do we know? I have no idea. I do not know. Okay, this is... But the question is, there's a window up there. Shiny torch here, I can't really see it from my cams. Is there? Can we get up there, do you think? Well, I think that's... The other room we were in, there was a ladder. Like, I should go up there and have a look, because there's obviously a room up there. And what's, what's in there? Just... Wow, well, it's just an outside, isn't oh, it's it? a light, isn't it? Some sort of weird, it's, like, um, sad. underground oh, window. Hello? It's a dead end. That was me who just banged out then. Bloody stupid man as well. Sorry. Bloody planks everywhere. Right. Okay, I just thought I heard something there. If you're here, can you make a sound? Did you hear that? right outside my house just I did. I can't see a damn thing. It's being convenient. <coughs> right. well, what made that sound? Hello? Where did you hear it from? Back here. Right, that's good. It sounded right. like it came, but I don't know if it was from back this side or further up. I just know it was this area. I don't know what would make that sound to them. Well, there's all kinds of metal and but there's nothing wood in there. Whatnot. No, no person in there. No, there's no one living. Oh, bloody hell! Oh, there we go. Ah. That's a hatch. Right, let me just put this. Uh, well, this is a health and safety nightmare. All right, now that the other side of this. Because that's about to fall. It's all right. Just the, the spin lid. All right. This is a nightmare. I'm now going to try and... Right. Okay. That answers where the window is. This the window's is a there. terrible So that's just the other side then, what yeah. you can see. Okay. So Careful. Bloody hell. That ladder doesn't even look stable. Standing at the, the top of those ladders. Yeah. I think Stuart's probably got my feet. Oh, there's not much up here, Stuart. Yeah, I've got the ladder, mate. Don't worry, I've got it. I've got I mean, the ladder. What is it? Carl does right. not look like he's doing up fun. that well. I think it's just a water tower. And, oh, no, hang on. Ah. It's the organ. This is where the organ is, Stuart. Oh, is it really? Yeah. Right. Good God. Amazing oh, as it what is. What earth would you get that up there? Nothing sinister. Really wow. Carry it, Stu. And that's the windows we were looking at before. On the outside. Absolutely fantastic. Wow. Oh, so, wow. I'm being thick here. Is there another room up there for us to go up there? Is it just storage that? It's literally full of organ. Right, okay. Alright, I've got the ladder. Your girlfriend can you never say that. You can work right, a ladder, King Carl. Right. Oh, I'm all right. right. I'm leaving the camera up there. Four more steps. <sighs> I've got you. I'm coming down. Sit. How many have you got? Keep coming. Two more steps. It's tight as anything up there. That's it, mate. Really is. Yeah. Right. There's nothing up there. There's absolutely nothing up there, though, apart from crap. 
just a foot. It, the, the whole thing is an, is is, a, is the organ. Yeah. It's just wood and pipes and right. Well, that doesn't give us any idea of where <laughs> those noises were, does it? It doesn't. Well, them noises have been and gone now. Let's just carry on and hopefully we might get some more, eh? That's okay. The plan. So if you're here, and if you made the noises and they're not just normal or natural, can you do it again? Right, we know no one's down there, don't we? I, I'm not If you much. turned, I, we both, I panned and you turned at the same time. Right, let's go down there. You know there's no... <laughs> Thank you. Do you know how creepy that laugh is you do? Sorry. Well, it is, it's, it's like you've, you've, you've turned demonic. <laughs> right, now there's nothing. Right. So we put, but that's the thing is, we both heard it at the same time. It's like, it's like something's rolling. Do you know what I mean? It's like yeah, yeah, absolutely, but there's nothing. The only thing, I mean, having said that, Carl, I mean, down here there's a steel wheel. Where? In there. But that, I don't think that would have been it, would it? Because well, that's there. not been moved in bloody years. See, by that's, looks of yeah. it. I don't know what else they could. Can you make the sound again? If you're here, you seem to be. Stu, listen, Stu, in front of you. In front of you. Stay, 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 stay. What, what is going on? Right, something's got to there push some something weird up there. Foot, what is it? Foot. Did you not? Did you hear that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was the same thing. I wanted to capture it on the front of this mic. It wasn't was that far away though. It was down here. In front of the front. Stay, 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 stay. Just. Right, something's got to push something up there. What is it? Stay, 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 That's rain outside, just so you know. It's the same noise. That noise you're hearing, there is absolutely no way that can be made down here by any piece of equipment. They're getting some weird noises. Not quite sure what they are. It was like something was rolling just down this corridor. It's the same noise. It sounds like either something was rolling it's the same or like heavy footsteps making their way down the Corridor, to me at least. It's the same noise. Like a creaking of a floorboard or something to that effect. It was definitely just, wasn't it? Like a. I'm trying not to say anything because we want to get it on camera, on, on sound. Yeah. Without talking over it. Why was it most haunted first? Is there anything that can be, like a chain can be pulled and something go up or down? You, you with me? Not down here, Stu. Because just, 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 I, can't, I can't see properly what's through here. It's just... If there's something on a timer or... Yeah, I just just, I'm sure it's all to do with the organ and... Pipe work and 
stuff to make the church. Oh, of course, yeah, they're the pipes there. Yeah. Well, I'm honestly. Yeah, they're in a oh, chair. Yeah. What the fuck oh. was that? Oh, hang on a minute. Just there is nothing to make that noise, Jim. There's nothing there. I've got my camera in that corner yeah. as well. I've got you in shot now. That's the corner. I mean, literally, there is nothing here. I'll show you right in there. Nothing at all. There's stuff leak. There's nothing that's fallen over. But I've got. I can see you through there now. Well, there's just nothing here. That steel wheel. Well, what is what there. the fuck was that? I. <sighs> I, I'm, I'm actually lost words if I'm being honest with you. I just don't know. There's something not nice here. But what would have died here? Who would have died here? Carl's thinking something potentially Does it need to have died? Could it have just come back? The land, what was there before the church was built? Yeah. There's all that, isn't there? Could be something with a vendetta. Maybe the, you know, whoever watches this, the locals who watch it, maybe they'll have more of a, an insight what to what's there before us. Can you do it again? Can you make another sound? There's nothing down these sides here. It's very warm this evening, everybody. I mean, that was pretty damn good. I've got to be honest. It's out. It was like someone just plastered something. I mean, if you step on this, it's not yeah, that. So it's not us. It, I've got that in shot now. It's not us. Because if I do that, you can see the... You can hear this. Well, I stepped That's on that earlier when we came in. But it wasn't that. that. It was me. It wasn't that. So what was it? It was more of a, it was a, it was much more of a, 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 a solid sound. Like somebody's thrown something. And there's nothing from up there. There's no ladders up there, is there or anything? It's just, it's it's just ceiling. ceiling. It's a solid roof. Well, I'm honest, I have no idea where. Oh, what the fuck oh. was that? Well, I'm honest, I have no idea where. Oh, what the fuck oh. was that? Well, I'm honest, I have no idea where. Oh, what the fuck oh. was that? Oh. So that's hot. Well, that you know. For this time of night, that's hot. But well, why don't... I mean, we haven't even bloody asked out yet. We've not said anything yet. We've only nothing. a little bit, not too much. Why don't we... I'll tell you what. Why don't we split up? Because we, we've, we've only got a specific amount of time. Easy for me to say. And, um... Shall I go up to the main church upstairs? Yeah. Do you want to stay down here? Yeah. Not particularly. Yeah, yeah I can do it. Well, I'll go, I'll go up there and good luck. If you need me, um, I've got my phone. I've got my phone. Is there a signal here? Uh, Mine's on flight mode. I don't know why I've turned it on flight mode. Mine's on flight mode too. Um, so I don't know if there's a signal, but if there is, we'll, if, we'll if there's any off. issues, I'll come find you. Yeah, come okay. find me, whatever. But right. Just take your time and you got your torch. Yeah, I've got my torch. Right. right. Hopefully, I might Saturday. find out what that noise was, eh? Yeah. Right. Well, you keep, you keep, you keep asking out, and I'll, yeah. I'll go upstairs. If anything happens, or we'll come and get you, and vice versa. Okay. Right now, <laughs> fuck that fucking door. Right now, I'm going to go upstairs to the main church. I don't usually get motion sick. I didn't yesterday. We're watching basically the same thing. This is my worst night. Like today I am. What's your worst nightmare, Stu? Believe it or not, this is my worst nightmare come true now. What and it specifically? Is, I Give probably us some won't details. believe me when I say this, but I'm actually frightened of the dark. I suffer very, very badly with claustrophobia and the dark. You've never mentioned that previously, and we've locked you in like. A large number of small enclosed areas. Areas. Um, apparently, he's also arachnophobic, which um, I get because I too am. Um, because everything that's just gone on, it wasn't a whole lot of stuff, but it was. It was stuff. It was paranormal. It couldn't have been anything else than bangs. Together. I just want everyone to know on an almost unrelated point, this is CautionSigns.co.uk. Um, they're a company that makes caution stickers for cars, um, caution stickers for 
you know, all sorts of things. Um, and they also happen also happens to be a company owned by Stuart. Uh, so if anyone ever needs any caution signs, please check out cautionsigns.co.uk and Stuart will send you some caution signs. And now, Stu, everything will be fine. Carl will be back shortly. He's not gone far. You've got a camera, you've got your torch in your hand, you've got your inhaler on you. Everything's okay. Nothing bad is going to happen, I can assure you. Just do your thing, be nice, don't be nasty, don't be disrespectful to the spirits who are here. Let me just zoom out a sec. I really do have to think and concentrate in this environment now and I do have to talk to myself a lot, which you may have known over the years. I'll have little conversations with myself. That's he does do that. In here, I'm trying to calm down. I'm not panic and freak out and freak out. The claustrophobia, I may as well tell you in case you don't know, started many years ago with me and Carl. Um, we got stuck in a lift about four o'clock in the morning. Brilliant. Now, that part of the building is all to the outside. All those doors. I say brilliant, that doesn't sound outside great for this. you. Um, I tell you what, guys, it does sound quite Paisley, funny. Just come see this church. It's just gorgeous. I don't really know how I feel about churches being haunted. It's not one of those things that stands out to me necessarily. Because they're like, you know, a place of God. I suppose they can be. The main lights are on, which I suppose is quite good because I can show you. I'm going to turn this from night vision to colour vision. Look at that. Is that not beautiful? That is quite nice. I know the lens is a little bit dirty here, which is unforgivable, but... How gorgeous is that? That is pretty. Isn't that just stunning? It's quite a big oh. church, to be fair, I'll give them that. These beautiful buildings. I've not been to a large number of churches. We have to churches. do everything to keep these together. Um, we really do. But I've been to enough to know that this is quite a nice one. Okay. Now, I'm going to go into some of these side rooms. They're off here. Wow. Can you imagine? Once not that long ago in the grand scheme of things that would have been full of people full and now sadly it's all empty God, this is just that is stunning. a shame to be fair so i know i'm doing a ghost hunt but you can't get away without commenting on that isn't that just beautiful it's a ceiling, mate. That's doesn't do it for me. Stunning. It's weird right, seeing Carl in like daytime rest. vision there. I'm right. personally not into okay. architecture. Now, these back rooms. So it means nothing to me. I'm going to. Right, the lights are off in there. I don't know whether. Get your night vision on, lad. Right. There I'll we go. Night vision. I'll just turn the light off in this room here because that's quite an active room. But I heard something here. Hello? What the? What's he here Hello? then? Because I didn't hear shit. Ooh, dragging. Fuck. That was dragging. Everyone hear the dragging there? Right. That was okay. a weird noise, to be fair. Sorry for swearing. These people were really I just grinning. heard a moan. Torches. Was that a moan? I know. The only person that's in this church now, downstairs, is Stuart. And I'm not going to hear him from here. 
Hello? Oh. Carl's a little bit jumpy. Right, there was a tap in here. Right now, I've just heard a tap in here. Okay, fine. Let's turn him up a little bit. There's a bit heater down there. Until he jump scares me. Oh, and it, it's on, so it could be the heater that's made that little sound. That would make sense. Are you here? This is one of the other active rooms. This is the other side of where I was before. So we're in coats. Can you show yourself to me? I'm just going to see if I can find anything about it on if Google. If you can. Oh, that's safe. Someone's been at the same. I'm not here to harm you or ridicule you. Nothing. Just here to. Massively exciting. Talk to you. Um, just sort of a church, you know. Can you move something in this room? Hello? Are you there? And we were stuck in the elevator. The building, said to be plagued by dark shadows, disembodied footsteps, unexplained moans, doors slamming in the dead of night, and even in some cases, reports of ghostly apparitions. Um, that's really all it says about the location online. For a long time, oh, see. the fire brigade had to come out and and do the business, but the lift was stuck in between the floor, you see. So you literally had to hoof yourself up out of the lift, and I was thinking, well, if I jump out of the lift, weight ratio, and one thing or another, the lift is going to give and it's going to cut me in half, but it didn't. I didn't know that they'd locked uh, the lift off. Somehow, I, mean, I don't know how they did it, but they, they, they blocked everything off, so that wouldn't happen. And ever since then, I've suffered very, very badly with claustrophobia. That's a reasonable the dark, believe excuse it or not. for I know I'm in the wrong job, but I suppose. It's kind of what I do now. Just talking like... What the fuck was that? We heard it. Did you hear that? Yes. Yes, Stuart, we did. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you very much. He's doing an Elvis impression. I think it was this. Essentially. Something. I think I, it, it could have it couldn't have been anything else. I'm I'm going to remove this now. No, it's too heavy. No. Maybe. It sounded a bit like that, but sort of less you... weighted. Come on, Stuart, get your fucking stuff together and stop pissing about. Yeah. Come on, you ask him, out. Stu. You can do it. Can you do something, please? If that... Come on, Stu, you're all right. Everything's fine. Um... Okay. So the spirits who are... <sighs> I'm actually struggling to fucking hell. I feel like I'm gonna cry. I'm actually struggling to get my words out because of a start talking and asking how I'm gonna cry. Hello? That's definitely something.
something around. I'm hearing noises. I'm hearing different kinds of noises. I, I can't pinpoint what they are. It's not like, you know, it's not like sort of tapping on wood or no. any of that. It's specifics. Specifically, it's not a specific noise I'm trying to say. I'm getting more. All right, now that was another sound, that was over there. Hello? What was that? What the fuck was that? There was something down there. I didn't hear nothing, Carl. Hello? Something was down here. Hello? I saw something, I heard something down there. Hello? This now Carl's been jumped. You don't don't fade in the ghost of Stuart. Yeah. I just saw like Stuart's little face Hello? appear out of nowhere, and it scared the shit out. I thought Stuart was fucking like running at the screen. Rocking sound. No, there's no chairs here that would make a rocking sound, I don't think. I mean, these all look pretty solid four legs. No, they're all normal chairs. Four, yeah, four legs. What the hell? Can you do that again? Can you make another sound? If I walk down this corridor again, will you make this the same sound in this room? Let me put the torch back there so you can see it. I don't know if really helping, to be fair. Can you make a sound again? Nothing. I definitely heard like a rocking sound. I'm sure by this point in the proceedings, I'd have played it back in the edit a few times, so you'd have probably heard it better than I've heard it at this point. <sighs> well, I certainly heard it. I don't know if it was necessarily as clear as he thinks it is. There's something inside me telling me not to ask out. Come on, you're all right. That's not gonna, it's not gonna happen. That's not gonna move, I know that. But it did move because there was a noise. Whoever's with us now, who's here? Make that box move, or the chairs if that was you. I'm almost positive it came from there. I don't feel too enthralled, if I'm being honest, about being here on my own now. I actually should have just gone off with Carl, if I'm being completely honest. No, Stu, you're a big, um, brave man. You're fine in the basement, as you are. Come on, mate, you're all right. Oh, yeah, you're all right. Let's just, let's just go and have a walk around, eh? I'm just going to nip to the loo, my lovely viewers. Uh, so wait there for two seconds, I will return.
Okay, I'm back. Let's go back to watching, and here we go. If there's someone with me, I don't even know why I'm asking out. I just no idea why I'm even doing it. Why I'm. Stuart, he's getting a bit caught up in losing I'm face. Myself through it. My name's Stuart. If you're here. I'm not. Let's go up these stairs. I'm not making any sense at the moment, and I'm, I'm fully aware of that. Fully, fully aware of this. So the spirits who are here now, I'm gonna go up these stairs. Maybe you can follow me. I don't know why I'm asking you to follow me, but go on, maybe you let's can. Follow him. Or maybe you won't. It's your choice, what you do. But all I ask is that you come and show yourself to me. Why would you even ask that, Stuart, if you're in a bit of a state in the morning? Why would, oh, goodness me. There's a groan in the back. I would even ask. Maybe it's Carl. For something to follow me. At the moment when I don't even want to ask out for anything to happen. It's just every now and again. I get really bad moments of claustrophobia. And, and at this moment in time, I'm having one of their moments. Hearing something, but there is a lot of rain outside. See, I'm not hearing Hello? much. Hello? Right now, this is. This is one of the rooms. I'm not hearing much. There's activity in before. And. Yeah. There's lots of things in here, as you can see, but that we had tapping and knocks and things moving. Can you make this piano? Go on, make Can you the piano make a sound on this piano? Can you do that? Now, I've had some success with pianos in the past. Come on, yeah, well, you're not having much now, are you, Carl? Can you make the piano play? Can you press a key within, even though it's shut? I'm gonna go with no. What was that? Something is moving. And I'm sure we'll walk, uh, I reckon he's gonna walk away from the piano and oh, the piano's gonna go off. off. Hello? What was that? I like dragging noises. Well, I'm hearing some strange noises. Oh no, it was the I step. Like I, angle. I thought there was a person there briefly. Hello? But there was not. It was a step. We'll give him that one. Oh, through there. Oh. Right, okay. Unless there is a Hello? person here somewhere. We're at the back of the church now. There's no one in this church whatsoever. There's just no one there. 
Right, and again, so we know oh, it's coming from within here. What's in here? Well, oh, that's this would be. Now, you see what's in here? Let's just have a look. Right, okay, changing rooms. You're seeing this for the first time as I am. And there's a loo. Beautiful toilet. Weird toilet. What do you mean beautiful? It's a weird toilet. I didn't think I was going to say that today. Just a weird right. So this, there can't be anything nasty here because this would all be a pleasant, because by the looks of it, this must be where civil ceremonies are taking place, I'm guessing. Or books are signed in celebration of an event. So this must be good. There's nothing evil here, to be fair. It doesn't feel bad. It just feels there's something here. And again, there wouldn't be anything evil. It's, it's, it's just a place full of peace and love, isn't it? Why would there not be something evil? Right, see, that's down here. Yeah, agree. Come what on. is it? Let's go down. Let's let's go find out what it is. I'm getting very dubious of Carl at the minute. Right. The last sort of episode or two, I've it's been this a bit, room. He's annoyed me more than now, some of the Nothing's changed. Others. That door's still shut. Nothing's changed. to say this is a super a superb place it really is it's lovely as I say it needs to be looked after and kept as people are doing here as I walk away can you make one last sound can you make a noise can you whisper to me Thank you. Thank you very much. Oh, just stunning. Ah, oh, what's this? There's water everywhere. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, wow. It's a huge leak. That's a big old leak. Down here to the floor. By the looks of the damage, it's not been there long. Just thinking, could that have been the rocking? No, the rocking noise I heard was right the way through there that couldn't be here. Listen. That could explain some of the tapping noises he's heard. There's a slight drip. And I'm not referring to myself, obviously. <laughs> There's a slight drip. That was a good joke, to be fair. But it's not the sound I heard. Right. What a great place. Back to Stu, the highlight of this episode. Can you come and bang on something? Make a sound? Let me know you're here. There's another gentleman that's gone off. I'm not sure where he's gone to. Um, he's gone to the other side of the church, I believe. I think so. Can you please do something for him? Can you do something for the both of us? I'm keeping the camera down there, just in case anything happens. Reasonable. Hey, what the hell? Listen. Do that again if you can. Come on. Now, there are breezes coming through here. I'm wondering if the breeze actually shook that door. Or was it something else that actually shook the door? I don't know, I mean, but I could, know I heard the door very much be a breeze to rattle, be if you like. This is me on hold, isn't it? That was kind of it. Oh. Shit. Yeah, it was just enough. Enough. That was kind of the noise. Hey. 
What the hell? See, not only was that kind of the noise, hey. for once I actually feel that like you can see the sort of movement from the door. What the hell? If you look at the handle, it looks like it's actually vibrating it did, it did, a bit it as it's not. It did. Or as it moves. But the door is quite a heavy. And, it, um, and when you pull it and you let go, it automatically goes back to the closed yeah, position, even though the door. If you push the left side, it will have enough room. Slightly open there. anyway. There is a draft down here. There really is. Come on. There's a lot of voices that he's just ignoring that I can clearly hear. And I don't quite know why he's ignoring them. If you're here... I guess he, beautiful, he must just know their outside voices, like... Can you move something for me? Can you show me you're here? There's lots of lights. There's a big chandelier over there. The chandelier's all down this side here. And on the other side. Yes, there are. Move one. Push a chandelier, that would be fun. Make Can you move drop. one of them or? Come and join me. Come join me in prayer. Come and join me in worship. This is a place you've loved. Taps. I'm hearing taps. Mm -hmm. Come closer. Are they taps or could that just be the dripping that we've already established is in this room? Come closer. Can you copy this? Thank you, sir or madam. Can you come cl closer to me? I don't know if you guys heard them there because they were a bit faint. Thank you, sir or madam. But Can there you were come a couple of me? knocks. There were a couple of knocks after Nothing Carl's Nothing to be afraid initial. of. I'm not afraid of you. Um, we're in a place of... That could be, you know... Unexplained. Peace, worship, the pattern sounded and harmony. a bit similar. In a place of love. I extend that to you. It's gone very cold. Come and sit next to me. I'd love to know more about you. Come sit with me. Come talk to me. Right, what the hell was that? There was a big noise, but I don't want to lose this. What do I do? What do I do? Still tapping. I'm going to stay here with the tapers, because this is what we're after. This is communication. The other could be anything. Can you copy this, please? Thank you so much. Right, to be fair, I'll give him it again. There were four there. That worked. Can I ask? Please come closer. He, he is talking to the spirit like it's an idiot, isn't he? Um, I do also think, yeah, I find that as well. Um, it's a bit weird. Please come close and sit with me. Oh, it's gone very cold. It's gone really cold. 
It's gone very cold. Are you here? Wow. It's very, very cold. Are you next to me? Oh, my hand is very cold here. It's colder. It's warmer here, but very cold here. That is how temperature works. Well, thank you. Heat rises. It's He's just proven that heat rises. Dark. I might be slightly worried. It's amazing what the light can do. Why has he got all the lights on, actually? That is a question. I don't know why, like I said to Carl before, I just don't know why this place would would be haunted, but it is, that's the thing, it is. I don't think people have been murdered and bludgeoned to death here, but again, it could be the land. You just don't know what's gone on over, over time, I guess, who's been here. What arguments have broken out? Has, have people been murdered? You just don't know. I don't. That is Maybe true. Maybe you, the viewers at home, the people of, um, who live in the Glasgow area, Paisley area. I do not. Uh, will know more about the I history. I am not from there, so I do not know. Um, of this church. Carl? Carl, is that you? There's no one down there. There's no one there, guys. There's no one there. So what was it then, Stu? It was either a ghost. I'm on the floor. I don't think it's Carl, mate. I don't know what it is, but I'm currently confident it ain't Carl. I heard footsteps, that's why I asked if it was Carl. It wasn't the door this time, the footsteps were along this corridor. I heard footsteps along this corridor. Definitely heard footsteps. I don't know it wasn't Carl now because he didn't hear me. He didn't reply to anything. And if it were Carl, Carl would have. Are you playing games, whoever you are? If you wish to communicate with me, if you wish to talk to me, If you want to come and shake hands, sir or madam, whoever you are, you're more than welcome to. You're absolutely welcome to come and walk up this, walk along this corridor and say hello to me and I'll say hello back, whoever you are. You have no need whatsoever to be frightened of me. I'm not, I'm not a bad person, I'm a good person. Carl's a, a cult, Stu's a good person. Shall I so tell you a bit about me. my age? Tell a us bit, a bit about me. Tell us about Stu. My name's Stuart. I'm 45 years of age. My birthday is, in the first, is on the 1st of April. I'm telling you all this so you've got more of an understanding who I am. The year we're living in now is... Um, um, 2020. Yes, it is. Sometimes when you, you talk like that and you, you tell them a bit about yourself and... I think they get more of a liking of you then. Can you come and talk to me? Can you just, can you just knock twice for yes, once for no? Are you male? 
No. Therefore you're female. Did you die in this church? No. no. Okay. Did you... Did you love this church? Was this church everything to you? Yes. Yes. So many better um, questions you could ask here, Carl. Well, thank you for coming and talking to me. I feel very peaceful with you, and if you are here next to me, um, if, and I'm looking at you, I can't see you. I can feel there's something there that's it's very cold. That's and not a, a yes or no question. Here, which I'm looking at now. Is there any way you can show yourself to that device? Is a mist? Or just move something? Yes. No. Okay. It's footsteps. Move them quieter, Hello? getting further away. Well, it's gone. It has gone. It's like it got up and walked away. I heard the footsteps, to be fair. They did She's sound like it was... Walked away. She was walking away. Wow. Well, thank you. Well, let's carry on. Well, that was amazing. Why did he stop asking questions? I know a lot of you will be thinking to yourself, why was that in night vision when it's light here? But why not? You're going to pick up a lot more in black and white than you are in colour, because there's so much going on in colour, but at least with just black and white, there's only the, the black, the white and the greys to think about. So when I'm in the edit and if I see anything move, I'm going to see it easier in black and white. So let's continue. I don't think that's true, Carl. I've got the camera just in the distance as well, just in case. Because that's the door that made the noise. I'm invested. If you can come and communicate, this door here, wherever it is there, you made that shake before, can you do it again? Come on, you've no need to be frightened of me. If anything, I should be, I should be scared of you, whoever you are. I don't live in Scotland, I'm not Scottish. Though, my He's mum's not. from Scotland, oh, she's from Kokodi. Scottish. We're learning. I have two children, Max and Macy. Do you have any children? If so, how old are they? The bloody annoying thing about all this, it's gone quiet now. I'm standing here telling him everything and he's pissed off. One minute you've got the door rattling, you've got the footsteps on the floor walking, I, which I thought was Carl, which it isn't because he didn't respond to me because he's obviously on the other side. And we had the noises over yonder. Mm -hmm. There were some noises, yeah. Well, I'm not telling you any more information. You've got to tell me something now. Come on, it can't be all one-sided. Did you hear it? I'm not hearing anything. Was you listening to me then when I said it was all one-sided? Eh? Right, for the folks at home, where I'm shining my torch is where I was before when I walked up the stairs. Okay. I go up them stairs, up and around, and it brings you to this balcony. And that is where we've just had footsteps coming from. Thank you. Thank That's you for that. Weird. So you can you hear me explain. and you are present. Now I know this, you come and tell me a bit about you now. Do you have any children? Are you married? What do you do for a living? Don't I'm going to keep the camera questions. on there. 
Are you divorced? How old are you? What's your name? All good questions. Come on, you must be able to answer at least one of those that I've asked for. Won't you tell me one thing and then I'll tell you something else about me? How many children do you have? Are they with you now? Come on, come and walk I'm along sure that what his method corridor is. up there, because that was you I heard. Come on, you can do it. Come on. Come on, you're there. You're nearly there. I know you're not a bad person. You're probably mischievous, but I think you're more intrigued to know why I'm here and why Carl is here. Well, the truth is, sir or madam, we're, we're here to see you. I've travelled all the way from Manchester to come and see He's you. He's trying. I'll give him that. And at very best, at least, you could at least show yourself. It's almost like he Maybe wants to call the spirit down around the table and but isn't have a chat. We could have a drink. Come on, you can do it. I know you can. I know you want to. You're probably trying. You may be speaking to me, but I can't hear you. I really can't hear you if you are trying to speak to me. Mm. Anyone who's ever done anything like this will know it's all or nothing. You get things, you get bangs, you get footsteps, you get doors closing, objects moving, objects even being thrown. And then all of a sudden, nothing. It's as flat as a witch's tit. Sorry. I don't know why it's like that. A, I Film don't know what thrown. all of the talking in the background is, because there's a lot of it. B, what was that sentence? And then all of a sudden, <laughs> nothing. It's as flat as a witch's tit. It's as flat as a witch's tit. And I don't know why. I don't know why it's like that. But it is. So, it's to be expected. Okay. I think I'm gonna call it a day now and go and see where Carl is. I don't know, he might be dead for all I know. He might be hung up. He might be um, hanging from the, the rafters or something. I really don't know. It's a bit I've not heard anything. Thank you very much. He's not dead. Thank God for that. Not again. Really appreciate it. Can't have him die twice. And with that, we ended our Most Haunted Extra at Coates Memorial Church. Until next time, sleep tight. Stop it before it plays. And that was the Coates Memorial Church episode of Most Haunted Extra. I don't think a lot happened in that episode, but let me know what you think in the comments down below. Um, in the comments down below, well, I'm, I'm live, not on YouTube. Let me know what you think in the chat. I personally am not that convinced by it. Though I am... Yeah, I agree with both. They go into a room, shout, and that's it. Yeah, it's not great. It is not great. It's not great. I will agree. Yeah, it's, it's weird. It's weird. I'm not overly sure how I feel about Most Haunted at some points. 
I liked some of it. Some of the episodes, like the one yesterday was quite good. Uh, some of them are less good. With that this evening, though, I'm going to end the stream there because I'm absolutely knackered and I'm going to actually have an early night. Um, so thank you for joining me. I will probably go live when I am more awake tomorrow night. Um, probably a bit earlier and we'll watch a longer proper episode of something it may not necessarily be most haunted but it will be something um so thank you for joining me and i shall catch you all later peace that's off screen peace